Yo, I want to talk about survival on days mm. everything's just everything. Mm. My name is Rodney. I'm Keith. This is our 5.30. 5.30? This is our daily 5.30 chronicle. daily chronicle. Yeah. This is our, this is our daily chronicle. I'm going to let we, Keith explain it. I don't even where know we chronicle, right yeah, where we chronicle our, our existence um, in the world of being dads and you know, starting two businesses, working full time and, you know, being husbands and doing all the things that we want to do in life. Um, and just the journey that we're on, um, regardless of the end point that it, it comes to. So we can learn from ourselves and hopefully our kids can learn from us. And you know what? Maybe you can learn a thing or two as well. So here yeah, we are so on video <clears throat> talking about survival. Funny let's thing about, though, yeah. this kind of has been a, they, a bit of a going theme of ours uh just that which i appreciate the 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 struggle that happens um more often than maybe it's perceived to happen if you're from the outside so so struggles real yeah struggles real uh well i mean i'll say from a parenting perspective like for me last night was horrendous Mm. It was horrendous. Neither child slept. Neither parent mm. slept. Oh. And um, and I got to get up and work today. So, you know, there's we had this video and we talked about showing up, like making a decision to show up and like be energetic and be happy. And I'm going to amend that. Uh, well, two things. One, this isn't this isn't something that's specific just to parents. Like I had nights like this before children like nice sure. couldn't sleep worried about a presentation or whatever maybe, like maybe you went out too hard the night before <laughs> hey like hey. it doesn't really matter what it is that yeah you up like you sure. were up, you were up so i don't want to say that i'm a i'm special because i have children i think everybody can experience this but uh so like we kind of said all right like that one of the last times this happened i was like all right like i could still come and be my best self mm -hmm. I'm amending that slightly and mm -hmm. saying, I don't know if I can be my best self in this moment. Mm -hmm. However, I can show up and just like do what I have to do. Like, I don't have to be negative. Like, I don't have to be evil. I don't have to be super like happy. I'm just basically what I'm doing right now is expending the minimum amount of energy possible to get through the things that I need to do. So that I don't drain myself any further than I already am, or much further, and I don't have to like nothing. I got, I don't have to let anything set me off. I don't have to be overly happy or enthusiastic. I'm just getting it done. Like that's it. I think I think that like there's there's a reality there about accepting your not best self, right? Like, and that's what we've talked about in the prior, like, get up, get after it. Or sometimes you just got to do it, even if you don't want to. We've yeah. talked about that a little bit before, but like, there is a truth in probably, you know, a fair amount of time, like as much as you love what you're doing or, you know, love being with your family or whatever, like there are just those days where it's like, I just got to be content with existence and not, I don't need to be happy about it. But I also, and I think this is your, this is the the, the meta point as you like to <laughs> say. I would have thrown, I would have thrown macro in there, but I, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Is that you don't have to be unhappy about it, right? Like there is a, you know, a, a difference between optimism and pessimism, but you don't have to be negative about it. You don't have to be happy about it. Right. But you don't, don't have, you have to, to be, be negative like, about it. Right. It's just simply accepting that it is. Like, that it is. And, like, and I'm not mad at any, like, well, and that's the difference. Like, I could be mad at my kids or I could be mad at the work that I have to get done or, like, whatever. I mean, and it like, could be frustration, right? Like, or annoyance or, because you're easily set off, like you said, for anything can trigger in that moment when you're just completely deprived, right? Look, sleep and then deprivation is a, is cruel, a real thing. <laughs> it's a real cruel. thing. <laughs> yeah. And, and just being able to... Not, like, so I am literally not my best self. Like, I, I, 
thinking capacity, reaction yeah. capacity. So I'm on like life support systems, like yeah. just trying to maintain so that I just, yeah. yeah. Like basically I'm checking myself. Like people ask me questions. I'm like, do I need to respond? And and like, what's the minimum effort I could put into a response right now? Just so yeah. that keep everything copacetic. And, and it's, and it's also, I mean, it's, it's to the point where, and I mean, I've been there. Uh, it's, it's, you got to be in that, that state of maximizing the energy that you have to the output that you need without burning yourself down. Like this. And then, I just hit and my then knee take on the a, desk. Yeah. Like, that's, it hurts. I'm it done. Really hurts. I'm out. Like, why? Not, not like, working today. Like, that's it. That's it. <laughs> I can, I just see uh, Kramer running into the room like, that's it. <laughs> yeah, man. I'm with you. Those days, uh, those days happen, and I give you credit nothing, for it. Nothing yeah. can go right. It's, it's raining cats and dogs. I got a roof, roof leak, and I'm just like, ah, ah yeah. can it just end? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, it can't. I got it. Keep can't. Going. We got we got some work to do. So, uh, but uh, I don't know. What do we ask yeah. everybody? Uh, and, <laughs> say that, that creative energy <laughs> is not the energy that needs to be expended. Are you in like, survival you, mode? Yeah. Like, what do you do when you're in survival mode? Like, do you get after it or do you do you shut down? Like, what do you need uh, and, to do? And, and if you do, like, throw some tips out. Like, I would love to know what you do. Yeah. How do you do? Yeah. I'm going to go meditate in a little bit. That's part yeah. of what I'm going to do. That sounds good. All right. Well, appreciate get after you. it. Hey, and even you. if it's just being in it, I appreciate you and all. I'm out.